boy Christian Ballard, Ballard Sports Media, coming at you with a quick video as the draft for the NBA, the lottery is in, and breaking official per ESPN, the Orlando Magic have won the lottery with the first overall pick. I want to get back to doing NBA stuff, man. I miss it. Uh, I do love basketball, obviously, as I've you know mentioned before. Played a little bit growing up in like a little league. Um, you know, camp or whatever. It was training. We didn't really have any games. But the big question, and I'm reading this from fan sided Orlando Magic Daily. Who will they take at number one as it is officially in that they have the number one overall pick? So here's the thing they need offense, they have some good defense in ways, right? Um, and they just need some scores, really, honestly. Um, I mean, they, ha they have some good defense. They got guys that can play inside. But you got to score points. I mean, they've had losses where they've only scored 70, 80 points a game, right? They got to have a big-time score. Some guys on the list, you look at Jabari Smith of Auburn, a guy that can play inside, can shoot the three, can also even play on defense if you need him to. Paolo Banchero um, is another one from Duke. Uh, so Jabari Smith, number one. Then number two, I would say Paolo Banchero from Duke, right? Uh, and I'm reading this from Fan Sided, again, Orlando Magic Daily. The need, a guy who can just get a bucket, a guy the team can dump the ball to and create a basket for himself or others. Um, Banchero has a bit of ways to go to create for others. He averaged 3.2 assists per game. He has, and he still has to show more improvement uh, as a three-point shooter. He made 33.8% of his three-pointers this past season. Um you know, so there's a couple things, but he's really good on defense. Um, it's a mystery who they're going to take. Um, there's some wild cards they mention in there, like Chet Holgren uh, from the Gonzaga Bulldogs. Um, a lot of people are saying his stock is rising in very, very large ways. Um, you know, everyone wants to know how good uh, Chet Holmgren Holmgren uh, can be. Um, overall, he was a good shot blocker, um, you know, and he played against power forwards. You know, he's he's really good inside to steal the ball, to make blocks in the perimeter, to take some shots, get some rebounds, get layups. He can do everything, especially on the defensive side of the ball. Like I'm saying, you know, the Orlando Magic, they really just need – uh, some good defense uh, when you look at it overall. Um, and so it's it's really, it, how do I put this? The Orlando Magic have to work on their defense. When you look at their stats and everything they have, uh, as I wait for this to pull up, I didn't really, I kind of threw this together last second as the news has just broken actually. Uh, I also got some baseball on in the background. Um, but, like, their last game, you know, you have uh, Jonathan Isaac, Chuma Oki. They got Jalen Suggs, um, R.J. Hampton, uh, Mo Bama, or Bama, Gary Harris. Like, they've taken some good players, but they just got to work with it. They got Wendell Carter uh, who's a center forward. They got a guard in Cole Anthony really, really good on the defense. You know, Jamal Mosley is a great head coach with the team uh, that I think could do some b uh, big things with the Magic. But the question is, who do they take number one overall? Uh, you know, again, do you go Chet Holmgren? Uh, do you go to Jabari Smith, who I think is probably the key favorite um, at number one? Him, and then, of course, as I mentioned, the first guy, that was on the list was Paulo Banchero, um, a forward from the uh, Duke Blue Devils. So there's a lot of different ways they could go at number one in the NBA draft um, overall. And uh, 
again let me see uh thursday june 23rd so they got a month to decide what they want to do um with their draft pick at number one but i want to hear from you guys in the chat what they should do i think they need to work on the inside defense um definitely get some point guards inside um and guys i think a guy like jabari smith out of auburn would probably be one of their best picks there at number one but we will see so the orlando magic winning the lottery getting the first pick taking anybody they want to off the board who do you got want to hear from you guys in the comments love y'all jesus loves you i'm gonna try to get back into some nba action and talk and maybe doing some streams for some games definitely when the next season starts up we'll be there so um but we're gonna try to get into as much sports as possible outside of football uh got baseball underway trying to get some of that uh up and going here at ballard sports media too so love you guys jesus loves you please like comment and subscribe right here to Ballard Sports Media for more sports content. And until next time, folks, Ballard Sports Media, check it out. Love y'all. Jesus loves you. Y'all have a great week. God bless. And I'll say go Lions. And from a Bama fan, roll tide. We'll see you later. Peace out.